My name is Nicholas Branker. I am a producer slash artist. I've been in the business, woof, maybe 40 years, which is actually before I was born. And, um, I've been doing it consistently since then. Um, it hasn't been an easy road. It's been a difficult road, as you could imagine, being a professional musician in, in the Caribbean. I've been fortunate to have traveled the world with different artists, playing with people like Roberta Flack and Eddie Grant, Cynthia Ray, Maxi Priest and whatnot. And um, <clears throat> I've also been lucky enough to be producing some of the greatest artists in the Caribbean. So I've worked with Edwin, Allison, Marshall, David Rudder, named them, Rupi. Um, and I've also become an artist of late, so I'm starting to record my own music. Well, Coscap has been doing great work. They've been trying really hard in what are very difficult circumstances um, on both sides because dealing with people who don't understand why music has to be paid for cannot be easy. And I respect them and appreciate the front lines on which they stand fighting battles for us. And then too, there is a way in which I don't think they are fully appreciated by their own members. They don't always understand how important it is for them to have their businesses set up properly, to register the songs properly, to make sure that all the works are properly cataloged and whatnot, so that better organization and administration can be done from this side. So, I mean, I really do respect how much struggle they go through to keep all the different constituents that deal with them satisfied and um, I just hope that as younger people come into the business that they recognize how important it is to be a member of an organization that is local that is protecting their rights and their interests and that they see a way to making it much more viable than it already is and to try and make sure that they're creating music that is just not for them and their mother and their father to like but it is generating income so that cost that don't have to keep sending money over to Barbados all the time and start keeping money here that's important so those are my final thoughts